Welcome, 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 beautiful Paris and gentlemen family. In today's video, we will be predicting the second leg of the round of 16 Champions League fixtures. But before we do that, we have to look at my last week's predictions because I feel they were really good. First of all, I predicted 2-1 City Copenhagen ended 3-1 pretty close. Real Leipzig, I predicted 2-2, ended 1-0, obviously. Not the best prediction. Bayern to win 2-1 versus Lazio. Obviously, Lazio won 1-0, so again, not the best prediction there. PSG to beat Sociedad 4-1. 2-0. We take that. Inter Milan versus Atletico Madrid. Beautiful prediction. 1-0, 1-0. I got it correct. PSV to beat Dortmund 3-2. Ended 1-1. Not the best. Porto, I predicted 2-1. And they won 1-0. I take that. Napoli, Barca. 1-1. I predicted 1-1. So re some really good predictions from your boy PSG. And, but now, even tougher fixtures. And this is when, you know, the big surprise that happens. This is when more goals will be scored. There were so many games here where barely two goals were scored. I mean, there was only one fixture where more than two goals were scored, and that was the City Copenhagen game. So I'm expecting many more goals here in the second leg. First game to predict is obviously Manchester City versus Copenhagen. Um, three one up. City, Copenhagen, City at home this time as well. I can only see a victory for City. 3-0. Real Madrid versus RB Leipzig report saying that Jude Bellingham is back. Will be will he be ready to fit and to start the game on Wednesday? Will be a bit interesting. But I see Real Madrid winning this game. They're coming in with a 1-0 lead already. Playing at the Bernabeu. I think Rudiger is back as well in that centre-back pairing. I can only see a Madrid dub. 3-1. Bayern versus Lazio. Bayern recently 2-2 versus Freiburg. Obviously, Papingano will miss that game due to his red card he got in the first leg. But I still see Bayern winning. I think Lazio will become in a bit arrogant and Bayern, Italia, Serena, fans on their back. I see them going through. 2-0. Paris Saint-Germain, obviously, two draws in their last two games, but Real Sociedad, at the moment, they're losing to Sevilla. And they've been absolutely disgusting in the 2024 calendar year. I, I can only see, once again, a PSG, very comfortable victory. 3-1 to PSG. Inter Milan versus Atletico was boring slash a bit interesting game. I think it's going to be the same, again, two defensive sides, but obviously, Atletico Madrid will have to push a bit more than they did in that first leg. They're at home. They won nailed down but enter that's what they like they want to play the counter-attacking game transition one of the best in europe i still see this game being very tight 1-1 portman at home this time versus psv and i mean they got a good result 1-1-8 to psv that's a good result coming in Ayo home stadium and that's why i'm picking a borussia dortmund to beat psv 2-1. Arsenal versus Porto. Maybe this is a bit biased because I absolutely despise this team. This has been one of the most overrated teams in the world, in the Premier League, in the Champions League this season. And I hope and I pray to God that Porto make it happen. 2-2. And lastly, but not least, FC Barcelona versus Napoli. Ever since that game, Napoli have come in into good form. Barca as well into good form. It will be a really interesting time that I will obviously do live watch along here on the channel, including the Real Madrid game and probably the Inter Atletico Madrid game. But I see Barca winning 2-1. And here are the eight teams to advance. Paris Saint-Germain, Borussia Dortmund, Real Madrid, FC Barcelona, FC Porto, Inter Milan, Bayern München, and Manchester City. Let me know in the comments down below what are eight teams you guys are predicting to go through to the quarterfinals. It'll be interesting quarterfinals and even more interesting semifinals. All the big teams are left. And as usual, that's been it from your boy PSG. And as usual, allez, allez, allez Paris.